Hi, and welcome back to Adobe Tutorials by J.S. Watt. Today we'll be working in Illustrator, and we'll be having a look at making pop art with Live Trace. First thing you want to do is have your black tool selected. Select your image that you want. You want a fairly iconic image. Uh, open up Live Trace, Tracing Options. In the Tracing Options, it gives us a few different things we can use. We're going to keep this photo in black and white preview what they've got to get started. It gives us the beginning of our vector drawing. We're going to mess with that just a little bit. Path fitting is how close the path will follow the area. Minimum area, how many pixels are in the minimum amount of area uh, that the vector shape will trace. And the corner angle, how tight the corner is going to be to call it a corner. Once you get something that you like by using the different options, it will set up a, a, a set of shapes for you. Click on Trace, Trace your shape, and then Expand it. Once the shape has been expanded, you will be able to see the different shapes inside of here by using your white tool and selecting with that. We'll be able to select the different groups, the individual shapes in here. We'll start with this eye. We start on this side, we want to change the color. We're going to have to change it from the grayscale that we're in into RGB, and then select a color for that eye. Select the next eye. Again, change from RGB and then change into RGB. And another color for that eye. Uh, we'll select this hair. Switch from grayscale to RGB. So a nice color of hair. Elvis as a redhead. Orange, like it. And finally, we'll select the bottom section. Um, turn that into RGB. And let's give it a nice, that's nice. And that's the beginning of making your pop art. Select back to your black tool. You have these individual shapes. And just to make this a little more interesting, let's go grab our warp tool, uh, crystalline tool. I'll just move that over, quickly drag that across, click and drag as you move it across, uh, in case you do something interesting. There we go. Now we're starting to talk art. That is Live Trace and the Crystal Tool in Adobe Illustrator. Thank you very much. See you next time.